here's a whole long bone, this whole thing. That's what is that? A long bone, right? So any long bone has a typically the same structure. Actually, this is one here, and then there's another one next to it. Okay, so the ends are the epiphyses. The shaft in the middle is called the diaphysis. Okay, and you can generally see where they split. There's like a little line right in here. Do you see that kind of, there's a little bit of a line that sort of goes across like that. It's made out of cartilage. It's sort of hard to see. When I change the light, sometimes you can see a little bit of the cartilage there. But it's just right across here. Okay. So this side is the epiphysis. You'll find some spongy bone in here. Some spongy bone in here. The rest of the outside of the bone is going to be compact bone, which is really nice and hard. Okay. So there's a lot of good compact bone right here. You can see. You can even just see that hard stuff right there. In between the compact bone in the diaphysis, you have that medullary cavity, which is a space filled with yellow bone marrow. So that's what all the soft stuff is. It's the yellow bone marrow in that medullary cavity. You see all that good stuff? Mm. Yeah, so we'll leave that there, share it with the other classes later, because that's a good example. Okay, so the periosteum is gonna be the skin that surrounds all of this bone, all on the outside. It's very, very thin, it's kinda hard to see in here. But up here is where all the joint structures are that we want, okay? So, on the tip of this bone, kind of capping it, there's our articular cartilage. Very, very smooth hyaline cartilage for frictionless movement. You'll find hyaline cartilage on this bone as well, right here, capping it, because these are the two bones that are articulating here. And there's another little articulation between these two here. And then a little one right there. So all of these bones are going to be surrounded by this fibrous capsule and the synovial membrane. So we'll try and find it here on this side. Okay. So if we follow this cartilage around, Right here, it kind of dead ends, right? There's like this thin sort of pink tissue. That's our synovial membrane. So the thin synovial membrane is going to line the inside of this cavity. It's going to produce fluid into the synovial cavity. And then outside of that membrane, you find this thicker stuff. This is the fibrous capsule. Okay, and that'll surround this articulation kind of for structural support. And um, the two together, the fibrous capsule plus the synovial membrane, make up your articular capsule. Okay, and I think that's all the stuff that you guys have to memorize. So.